Hello Life Skills class and hello Career class. Today, once again, we are going over, we went over it months ago, we have some additional information. I want you to and send them all to me. Please pay attention. Life Skills will have its own questions. Career class will have its own questions. Let's get started. Please keep in mind that making business calls takes practice, but make yourself do it. Making a business call is nothing like making a personal phone call. Always have paper and pencil ready. Write your questions ahead of time and leave room for the answers. After the call, don't throw out the paper, save it. Before you even make the call, write down the date, write down the time of the call. And always write the name of the person you are talking to. If you're not totally sure that you heard the name correctly, don't be embarrassed to ask the person to repeat the name. If you need to, ask the person to spell the name. It is always possible that months later, you may need to speak with someone else at the company. They might ask you who you spoke with. You need to be able to say the date and you need to be able to say the name of the person. It's not right to just say, oh, I don't remember, but he had a young voice. Be sure to end the call very nicely. Say something like, thank you for your help. Have a good day. And here now is the most important part. Please pay close attention. This has happened to me many times. It is going to happen to you. If the information you receive does not sound correct, or if you really didn't understand what the person was explaining to you, or you just want to make doubly sure, then call back. Of course, you won't want to speak to the same person. If you're still in doubt after that, if something just doesn't seem right, then nicely ask to speak to a supervisor. Life skills students, you need to send me the notes and you have two questions to answer. What would you say to the person on the phone if the person does a fantastic job answering your questions. And life skills students, what would you say to the person if the person is simply speaking too fast? Career class students, please send me the notes and answer these two questions. What if it's obvious to you that the person on the other end of the phone does not know the answers to your questions. What would you say to that person? And career class students, what would you say to the person if the person on the phone is speaking too softly? Okay, everyone, answer your questions and send me the notes. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.